hypnosis going on right here on our air. I'm told I got to give them 15 seconds again. Look very closely into the spool, and then at the end of 15 seconds here, we are going to have him drop that down and look at his head at that point as we take you to a break. We're going to talk about it when we come back. All right, make the move. Did it work? Of freedom. Accordion, Indiana man is using hypnosis to have fun, and now he is helping out the crusade for children. Hypnosis by Randy is a show custom designed to its audience, and next Friday's show will benefit those who need it, the crusade. Randy Emily joins us now to talk about the show and why he decided to choose the crusade. So let's start right there before we get into hypnosis. Why is the crusade important to you? Crusade is very important, Andy, because my sister, Linda May, died of cerebral palsy at age of 12 actually in 1950, four years before the crusade was created. So uh, it, it's, it's really close to my heart. So I thought, well, I could do something for the crusade for children at the same time remember my sister. 1950, so this 58 years later and this yeah. is still very close to your heart. Yes, tell, tell me a little bit about hypnosis. What, what's actually happening here? It's actually, uh, uh, it's a restful state of your mind where you go into the subconscious mind. People know it, they use it for smoking, weight loss, and other, w other things out there, but hypnosis is very, very, very fun. Uh, from a hypnotic side, you can just relax and just let all the stress go. If I don't want to be hypnotized? No, I can't can, You can't you. hypnotize me? No, but if you want to get hypnotized, I can sure make you act really, silly, really fast. And it, and it has to be a willing you mind? Have to, you have to want to be hypnotized. You cannot make somebody do something against their morals or anything they don't believe in. If they want to have a blast, they'll have a, they'll have a cool time getting hypnotized. And let's talk a little bit about that effect that we were working on. But that wasn't really hypnosis. No, that, what we tried to do, we were just playing with people. Yeah, that was funny. And people probably at home got a kick out of that because they had a chance to see hypnosis and how uh, you can just trick the mind a little bit. But hypnosis itself is used in a very helpful way. But from a fun side, I can make somebody Barney Fife or I can make them a soldier. I can make them think paper uh, napkins or $100 bills. And, and that happens in your show. Tell yes. me a little bit about That's your show. People come place. out with their willing minds and That's they want right. to see. What are they going to see? They, they volunteer. They'll step on a stage. I'll hypnotize about 12 or 13. Not a big stage, but it holds 500 people. And uh, I'll have them, oh, maybe fishing. I'll have them driving cars. I'll have them doing all kind of crazy stuff. How would you learn to do this? Where does it come from? <laughs> in 1976, I was hypnotized on stage at IUS. And I just got a kick out of it because the relaxing part. It's like everybody else. I don't really believe in it. I was a counselor for 27 years, and during that time, I used self-hypnosis to help myself personally, which was a good thing, and it really was a, a great thing to do for myself personally. And then in, as time went on, I took classes, and I finally went to a two-year training program. I hold a bachelor's, a master's degree. A lot of psychology background helps with hypnosis. That certainly sounds fascinating. Oh, it's a blast. We appreciate you coming in. Thank and, you very and, much. And congratulations on the cause with your sister 58 I will. years later. Well, that's great. Could I say something, Andy? Uh, Quick Crusade one. for Children, you can make your check out to the Crusade and count it off on your taxes. Oh, absolutely. That's a good thing. Thank you. We also want to let our viewers know that that show is Friday, March 7th, 8 o'clock at the Cordon Jamboree on Hearst Lane. Tickets just 10 bucks. And again, it benefits the Crusade for Children. For more information on tickets, call 812-738-7280 or just go to our website site whas11.com we will link you up from there people use hypnosis to stop smoking to sleep better and now to raise money for the whas crusade for children we did a hypnosis show in Corden, indiana march the 14th to raise money for the crusade for children and we raised a grand total of fifteen hundred dollars Right. All from hypnosis. We love that. Randy Emily says he'll always support the crusade in honor of a sister his family lost when she was just 12 years old. And he's appeared on the new news oh, before yeah. to talk about that. Yep, fascinating stuff. And, you know, it's one of those fun things. And, and really, the weather's even fun today. It's a little bit on it's the cool hip side. Hypnotic. Yeah, exactly. It's, it's yes. drawing you outside. It is. It's making you me want to go. go. You must go. Yeah, lots of blue sky out there right now. Little